So it's February 10th, 2009. Completely uninteresting day, uh, like any other. I'm actually going uh, that morning. I was riding my bike to a dentist appointment, and as I was crossing an overpass on my bike, uh, about halfway across, a uh, it was a winter day, so it was like minus 10 degrees Celsius already. But a uh, really cold uh, cold front was coming in from the north, and it was hitting just as I was halfway across this overpass. So I'm riding along, and I look to the northwest, uh, sort of up the road, and I see the lines kind of converging. So it's something like something like that, and that's just as the uh, as the storm front hit. So what do I do? I, like any other day, I would do that. I, I, have, I have a camera with me on my bike, so I stop, take off my uh, my winter gloves because it's really cold, grab the camera out of my pack, line up the shot, and take a photograph of it. It's part of my usual uh, photo a day project, so I've got the camera with me most of the time. Pull it out, take a shot, bundle up, go to the dentist, don't think much about it. I get to work and I post the photograph online, where all of my photographs get posted. Uh, using a Creative Commons license. Now, I use a Creative Commons license basically so that anybody can use the photographs for anything they want without having to ask me. Now, why do I do that? It doesn't cost me anything. They can use the photographs for, to be in books. Uh, in this case, I was contacted a few months later by an editor of a small uh, newspaper in my in my province called Alberta Views Magazine. I'd never heard of the magazine before, but the editor contacted me and said, uh, we found the photograph on Flickr and it actually illustrates very well an article that they wanted to publish. Could they use the photograph? Um, I, absolutely, I said, it's under Creative Commons, help yourself for free. And they were, uh, they were quite thankful. So it wound up as a result of uh, just stopping taking the photograph, putting it on Flickr. It got used at, uh, in a pretty prominent way uh, in, a, in a magazine uh, talking about issues of, uh, of growth in, in the city didn't cost me a thing, it's something I did anyway as my photo a day project, but as a result, a small magazine was able to do something that they wouldn't have done as well otherwise. Uh, they would have had to settle for some kind of stock art or something, stock photos that wouldn't have uh, fit their need. So that's one small story of openness, I wouldn't call it amazing, but just in the course of doing normal activities in the open, assigning your Creative Commons license, people are able to take advantage of the work and that's not at a cost to me. It's something I'm doing anyway, but I'm able to help other people out by putting things out there in the open. A very small story of openness, but it's kind of cool to see a photograph that I took of something I would have done anyway to see in print, uh, and seen by people that wouldn't have seen it otherwise. Most of the people that read that magazine wouldn't be on Flickr, so they would never see it.